I am a proud Liner, but even more proud Latina, uh, Dominicana. Uh, aquí en esta comunidad. I am proud not only to um, be here with all of you, be, um, be, be from Lynn, um, ser de aquí de Lynn, pero también soy muy orgullosa de mi cultura latina. I should preface everything I say with the fact that my dad, uh, he passed last year. And I think the reason I share that is because I've spent the last almost seven years in Lynn away from my family. And Lynn is the only place in New England that gave me any sense of home. The first time I came to Lynn, there was a garden in the middle of the city. And I said, what was this town that built a garden in the center of it by the water? And why does it remind me of a place I know? Or when I find food from like 28 different countries around me, I get why people come here because I came here for the same reasons. I'd be curious for you to tell me what brought you to Lynn. What reminded you of your grandmother? What reminded you of your home or your barbecues or your dinners or your holidays or whatever it is that brings you some semblance of joy? So when I talk to you about Lynn, I'm telling you about immigrants and I'm telling you about queerness. I'm telling you about sacred family time with chosen family and blood family. Lynn was the place that I told my mom, ¿Sabes qué, ma? Yo creo que encontré mi casa. Creo que tengo familia acá. Siento algo aquí que no sé que es diferente. And I don't think I could live anywhere else. So this afternoon, we are recognizing some tremendous Latino figures in our community who were nominated by their peers. These were these were nominations that came into us from, you know, from the community. So I think it speaks volumes to the work that's happening here.